<laughs> he said, no, no. Yeah, yeah. How you doing? I'm doing all right, man. It's kind of hot out. Why don't you on inside? Yeah, yeah. They won't let us. I think, yeah. I think, yeah. I think the big shot. I where to say that. Talk about how many weapons you got and what you're going to do with them this fall. Man, everybody got a chance to make big plays this year. You know, a lot of young guys in there, too. And uh, they learn the plays during, throughout camp. So I'm excited to get them on the field. 13 it, days before the uh, first game, how, how game ready is this offense? How close to being game ready is It's pretty this close. Offense? It's pretty close. But, you know, close ain't good enough. So, you know, we got to keep preparation and uh, keep working hard and keep the young guys going and, you know, get our bodies back before the first game. You feel like you guys are on a track to be game ready? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. How much better are, is the offense? Everybody's talking about, you know, last year is like, <laughs> we can't do this, let's try something yeah. else. Now you're set on one thing and doing it well? It's going to be a lot faster this year, I feel like. You know, it's, uh, last year was pretty much slow because, you know, a lot of guys didn't know what they was doing, you know, with new offense, things like that. But when you're on, under the, uh, Coach Meyer and the uh, new offense coming back around, it's a lot better, you know. Is the playbook bigger? More no. More options? No, same. I mean, you know, with the new guys coming, you, you, you can spread it out a little bit more, so. The nine practices in six days, how much did this team grow through that? <laughs> uh, man, that was crazy. You know, uh, when he said that, you know, a lot of guys got big guy. <laughs> and, uh, you know, we accomplished it. You know, just keep working hard and just get in the ice tub and, you know, getting treatment. You'd be all right. How much better did you see this team get through that? <clears throat> Man, you know, it, it, you know, you gotta gotta sleep well at night. You know, you gotta get up. You know, you got a lot of fluids in your body. You know, like keep the game going. You know, you just gotta keep your body right. You had trouble with some fumbles last year. How do you address that? What have you done to, to try and protect the ball better? Coach Herman always talks about that, and uh, he always points that out when I carry the ball low, and uh, I try to fix it throughout practice and things like that. I'm getting much better at it though. Just how different do you feel as a quarterback this year? I feel. I feel like I know what I'm doing. You know, everybody, everybody know what they're doing with the, the plays, the routes, and, you know, reading the coverages and things like that. It's going to be much easier on me, too. You guys are ranked number two. Is that about where you would put you guys? Uh, it's not about the ranking. You know, I just go out there, you know, trying to win each game, every game. How is Kenny for uh, uh, being as mobile as you are, you, you, you guys gave up a lot of sacks last year. What are you doing uh, different this year maybe to uh, address that? Uh, you know, I got to fix some mistakes from last year. and. Uh, you, know, you gotta keep practicing and practicing, and you get better at it. You know, you know, just try to fix a little thing. I mean, you maybe tuck it and going more this year. Can we see, or what do you think? <laughs> uh, you know, the play breakdown. You know, I try to make something with my feet happen, but I'm still looking downfield. Do the expectations change year year to year? Is it always you gotta go win them all? Uh, coming off last year, what? Even if we didn't go, you know, 12 0 last year, I feel like Ohio State you always gotta win each and every game. It's a big school, you know. One of your teammates, when asked what he expects out of you this season, did a Heisman pose. <laughs> are they, are they, I won't tell you who it was. But, um, are they teasing you about it? Is there much discussion about it, Braxton? Nah, not at all. They don't talk about it at all. You know, if they see it on ESPN, they might mention it to me. You know, if they see me walking down the hallway or something, but <laughs> they don't really bring it up as much. Braxton, could you talk a little bit about Kenny Guyton as a backup? With this? Is that a little bit of confidence that gives you reassurance that he's back there and he knows what he's doing as well? Yeah, you know, Kenny, my big brother. You know, uh, we got mutual respect outside of football, too. And, uh, you know, it um, feels good as, you know, he can tell me what I'm doing wrong. He sees behind, you know, behind practice, things like that. He helps me out a lot. And what about the fact that when he did step in for you last year? Felt good. He already told me when, when I went down, he said, I got you, man. <laughs> so I felt good going into the ambulance, though. How have you, uh, you seem much more at ease with interviews, handling all this kind of stuff. Uh, do you think you've gotten better at it? Uh, you know, working with Jerry with right it? here, man. You Jerry help you out? <laughs> all the time, yeah. He, he coached you up? Yeah, coached me up a little bit. You trying to get better. That, huh? <laughs> 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 Two more questions. <laughs> <laughs> so he told you this is coming, you got to be ready. I mean. Uh, you know, he just points me out to the side, you know, he's, he's uh, Somebody's like speaking on ESPN, like you know RJ3 always on there, and Russell Wilson. He just points it out, little little pointers, things like that, to help Price, me out. Yeah. Where have you definitely gotten better since the start of camp to now? What have you definitely gotten better at? Uh, Besides talking and Jerry <laughs> Emmings help. I say uh, timing and ball placement. That's and what does that mean? Talk talk about what that means. Uh, you know, man coverage. They always say it's covered, but you know, timing and ball placement always be man coverage. Were there times last year when you? got the ball in the backfield and you what did you see 
then and what do you see now? Do you see more specific stuff as you look in the secondary and things like that? Just talk about how much you've grown in that respect. Yeah, uh, before the play start, I know where like the defensive guys going. You know, it's crazy because uh, Von Bell just brought that up today. He said, "How you know I was blitzing today?" I'm like, "Man, it's your body posture, man." So, you know, <laughs> I'm getting better at things like that. Two more questions, Braxton. What do you have to know as a quarterback for this offense to really go as fast as they wanted to go with the up tempo? What have you gotten? better at in that aspect? Man, they got to get the big guys in front going. You know, uh, they always, you know, they 300 pounds is you know, kind of tough going fast like that all the time. So just got to keep them going each and every day. How much have you worked on that in practice, the up-tempo aspect of the offense? All the time. All the time. Yeah, they, they talk about it all the time. You, you know, the leader always got speaks, and uh, you got to get the guys going and get them to the line fast. Just how fast do you expect to go? <sighs> you have a goal in mind? Trying to, uh, you know, get 12 guys on the field on the, on the defensive side, you know, subbing in, in and out, and get a flag and get a big play. You want, is there a number on the play clock where you're looking at? Oh, no, no, no. You want to throw it 30 times a game. You've talked about that and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, do you think that's coming? What, 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 what do you feel is coming in that regard? I told Coach Herman today about that. He said, well, you know, about the game plan. I said, well, Coach, we don't throw it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so no doubt about that. So we'll see what happens, man. Thanks, Thanks, Thanks.